Well, you probably know the opening music to the long-running TV show Cops. Now the show wants to partner with the Fort Myers Police Department to film some episodes, but at least one city council member isn't sure it's a good idea. Wake News reporter Adam Wright is live from police headquarters with more. Adam. Yeah, Lois, tomorrow the Fort Myers City Council will vote on whether to allow the show cops to film the police department. That's happened before, but some are wondering if now is the best time to do it again. The last time the TV show Cops partnered with the Fort Myers Police Department was in May of 2015. We're at Michigan right now. Since then, the department has hired new chief Derek Diggs. And a deadly mass shooting following a teen night outside Club Blue made international headlines. To this day, the case remains unsolved, as do several other recent homicides in the city. It's got a bad rap, this area. Now, COPS wants to bring its camera crews to follow Fort Myers police officers once again. It needs the city council's approval, though, first. And Councilman Johnny Streets recently told the news press, quote, From a professional standpoint, until we do better with relations between the community and police department, I probably wouldn't do it right now. We asked people around town what they think about the show filming in Fort Myers. I think it's a, it's a good idea to kind of bring a little bit of, like, action into Fort Myers. And you see that on national TV. Who's going to want to come and buy property here or open a business or even vacation? So I don't think it's a good idea. Maybe it'd be good for them to, you know, show how, what cops have to go through. The Fort Myers Police Department tells Wink News it has no comment on the matter prior to Tuesday's council meeting. Now, I talked to City Councilman Johnny Streets on the phone today. He told me he's not sure how he's going to vote tomorrow, and then he hung up on me. I also called Fort Myers Mayor Randy Henderson to see how he feels about this, but haven't heard back yet. We'll let you know what the city decides tomorrow. Live in Fort Myers, Adam Wright, Wink News. Now. Adam, thank you. Cops wants Fort Myers. But does City want show? Fort Myers, Florida, the long-running TV show Cops wants to film in Fort Myers again, but at least one city councilman isn't sure it's a good idea. The city council will vote Tuesday whether to allow the show to partner with the Fort Myers Police Department as it's done multiple times in the past, most recently in May 2015. Councilman Johnny Streets expressed reservations about the idea in a recent interview with the news press. From a professional standpoint, until we do better with relations between the community and police department, I probably wouldn't do it right now, Streets said, with a sigh. Improving ties between the force and city residents has been a key thrust of Chief Derek Diggs, who took over in August. He began a series of community forums and credited a new gang suppression unit that gathers intelligence from residents for preventing probably about five mass shooting incidents over a two-month span. It comes in the wake of the Club Blue mass shooting in July that left two dead and 18 others injured, and the October 2015 Zomagon shooting that killed one and hurt five more. Both are among several unsolved crimes that have taken in the city place since cops last filmed here. Along the way, Fort Myers gained a reputation as a dangerous place. It's got a bad rap, this area, Fort Myers resident Betty Dratwa said. Dratwa isn't high on the idea of cops beaming images of police activity in Fort Myers around the country, believing it would deepen negative perceptions and hurt local real estate businesses and investments. I mean you see that on national TV, who's going to want to come and buy property here or open a business? Dradwa said. Or even vacation? Cape Coral resident Samantha Lloyd was going to move to Fort Myers before others pointed to the crime and talked her out of it. But she thinks cops could help Diggs and his officers accomplish their goals. Maybe it would be good for them to, you know, show what cops have to go through, and maybe people will respect the cops, Lloyd said. Streets said Monday he doesn't know whether he'll vote for or against having cops in the city and refused to elaborate further. Mayor Randy Henderson didn't respond to a request for comment. 